Hello friends, I'm Colonel Failure and this is Transport Fever on the North Atlantic map. Uh, we start today by following this magnificent truck, uh, which is currently delivering food that has been flown in from Port Nelson uh, over to Europe. And, uh, and we're going to make a delivery into Berlin. Uh, and, uh, and the reason that I'm following this truck will become apparent quite shortly. Well, I mean, not least of all, look at the magnificent vista of trains going past in the background. Let's go rid of that. There you go. Getting away my magnificent vista. Um, yes, I didn't see. Look, we're already having to slow down a fair bit here. Good to see some progress. Good, good progress. There's another truck crossing over here. Now there's some more progress. Progress is a good thing. Uh, but now we're, we're coming into the heart of Berlin, and uh, and it's it's all going to get just just a little bit trafficy. I've no idea who this guy is, or uh, or what he's selling. I, I assume he's doing something that's that's valuable to humanity. Uh, anyway, here we go. Uh, if we're lucky, we'll get across here first time. Uh, and there's another one. Look. Ah, maybe the, maybe he's, maybe he's shipping bricks. Run that guy down. He wasn't looking where he was going. Um, yes, we're, we're following this truck because it takes a very convoluted route in order to deliver food uh, into the into the heart of the city, um, in amongst all of the all of the progress that is happening. I, I like a, a truck driver who changes lanes willy nilly, uh, keeps the keeps the other drivers on their toes. And as you can see, I mean, we've got you know progress is happening all around Berlin at the moment. And we're not even we're not even delivering everything correctly. We, we've got quite a bit of uh, of work to do here. There we go. Yep. Go down this tiny, tiny residential street. It's not really that residential, but you know, I, I, the point is is made nonetheless. And then round the corner, he drives like I do in in truck sim. Um, but here we go, reaching our destination. And all of this is uh, is commercial. Uh, so uh, so you know we're we we're, we're delivering exactly where it needs to go. But uh, this was not exactly the quickest delivery in the history of the world. And delivered. Right. So, uh, so there you go. Yes. I mean, if we if we look at that route here, uh, after autosave comes in, just in case my bacon requires saving. Uh, there we go. There's there's the there's the full route. Look, it's it's not quick. And in the last episode, or over the last few episodes, we have hooked up. The ability to uh, to do that with a train. So today, that's that's going to be kind of the theme of the day. Although, do I keep running trucks to Berlin? I just don't know. Stay tuned. We'll find out. So the main reason for focusing on uh, on goods at the moment is because our our brick setup over here, our, our construction materials, uh, we need to transport from here uh, over to the main distribution hub, right there, uh, in order to you know ferry this stuff around. And I'm questioning whether we go with, uh, I mean, we go, we're going to go with um, mixed consist trains no matter what, and those consists will have. Uh, storage for food and they will have storage for uh, fuel and they will also have storage for how old is that plane hello there uh, now just a just a, a minor thought here but uh, let's let's get you replaced with something a little bit more you know upmarket let's go with the uh, the 757 here uh, we'll make it a, a sparkly orange because I, I dread to think how old the planes are that we've got on this route. Anyway, uh, stop getting sidetracked, man. Uh, yeah, we want to bring bit brick up in here, and eventually we will also bring goods up in here. So I want to be able to distribute everything. Um, from the port, ta -da! we also want to uh, bring in... Hold on, what's the port? Not in, it's in range of that, so we're going to have to do a bit of ferrying. That's that's fine. Um, yeah, so from the from the port, we're going to bring in oil as well, uh, fuel oil, that is. Uh, so we basically need uh, a means of, of shipping all of that around, um, which is gonna be fantastic. Now, the other thing that this, this possibly offers up is instead of this truck route we've got currently seeding stone into the brickworks, we could uh, potentially double dip on the train that's gonna bring uh, construction materials up here. 
Uh, we could possibly take stone back again. Won't that be a thing? Uh, so let's, uh, well, I mean, how, let's have a look at that first and see, see where it gets us. Uh, it could be that it's out of range, uh, in which case there's, there's precious little I can do about it, apart from making, maybe, making use of this truck stop. Uh, but we'll, uh, we'll have a look. Uh, so I reckon go around this corner here is the, it's the right way to go about it. And then hook it up to there, except let's get rid of this, this old school road and, uh, you know, come up with something, you know, fresh, modern, tasty. There you go. Right. You don't get much more fresh, modern and tasty than that. Now, are you in range of the station? I think it's safe to say no. Where does that range? The range ends here. So there is, uh, maybe if I got rid of the kink, maybe we go right angles. We might be able to might be able to pull it off. Let's have a look. So if I were to go in a straight line over there, or, or a pretty straight line over there, how does how does that feel? Still no closer than it already was. Oh well. So what we're going to need is we're going to need a, a, a truck to do a little bit of ferrying, and this is just just to uh, allow us to uh, to double dip on the uh, uh, on the on the transport route. Uh, what do we got? Medium city? No, I don't like any of that. Large industry, small city. What does what that look like? No, yeah, that might do. Presuming it's got some uh, some storage on there, so it really is going to be a very short little, you know, hop, skip, and a jump uh, in order to to you know cross from between those two. Uh, the other thing I need to do is I need to hook up this road to well anything really. Um, currently not connected to a uh, sausage. Uh, we got some, some some legacy road that's that's just hanging around there for laughs, I suppose. Uh, let's get this bit hooked back up. There you go. AI, do it. Do the do the the AI thing. Um, but yeah, we're going to want to make sure that we uh, we keep all of this, you know, relatively well connected together. Even if I end up retiring the trucks afterwards. Uh, where are we? Large country road. All right. So if we uh, if we kind of follow the curve of the track round here. Just just because it's, you know, it's a, it's a shapely way to proceed. Or is it? Is that what we want to do? Is that really what you want to do? Just just stop it for a moment, will you? What would be kind of cool would be to pop a bridge from under here over those two and then connect up. That doesn't solve the problem. What would be cool then? Uh, can we get over there? If we go as far as... There may be... Don't... No, 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 no. You're, you're, you're doing the thing that makes it likely to crash, so don't do that. Two buildings will be removed. That's an acceptable casualty list. But... No. Not that. Okay. Have we got another bit of road here we can use, perhaps? So we could go like that. Uh, again, I'm not sure if I've got the... Yeah, I started a bit late. So if we start like there... And then go like that. There we are. Nice, big, long, chunky bit of bridge. Uh, and then, uh, you know, casualty of war coming up as we uh, as we bulldoze whatever the hell it is that's in the way. Uh, come here. Uh, give me that one. Three buildings will be removed. I'll get over it, and so will they. So then we'll run this round here, and, 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 and you know this is a connection I probably won't even end up using, but uh, you know that's that's connected up slightly more uh, effectively than it wasn't previously. See what I did there. Uh, also beneficial might be something like that. This is this is more of a challenge, but again, it's it's gone for it. Uh, we'll take that as well. Thank you. Uh, Hang a hang out a corner around the airport, and then down onto. Ugh, no, that's that's pretty hideous. Just I just want a little straight line here, please. 
Right, onto the corner there, like that. Marvellous. And take that over onto there. That gives us that gives us some choices, and it also means that I can uh, make use of the the truck depot that I've got here uh, without any issue at all. So the uh, next stop, the next the next plan here is going to be to set up my my brick collection. Now I don't have a train that I'm going to retask. We're coming out on this line here. Uh, it's going to need to be quite the beast, and I might even need you know I might need more than one of them. Uh, give me a give me a signal. There we are. So as is you know as is traditional in order to get these things working correctly, we need to uh, we need to start uh, by delivering from one end, and then we can get the others going. That must not make any sense at all. I, I swear to God it was English. Uh, but there we go. So we're coming out onto this first platform set here. So if we. Uh, if we waypoint that, and I think what I'll probably do is I'll waypoint as I add, rather than setting waypoints immediately, um, and that should make life a bit easier. Uh, right, let's uh, let's set this as a route. New line, please, uh, from Paris Holt, which is not a good name at all. This is going to be uh, Hamburg, uh, uh, whatever I want to call it. Um, uh, something distributy, distribution. All right. Well, you know, we'll we'll settle for that for now. It's it's hardly the most startling piece of imagination ever, but we'll go with it. Right. And then over here to Paris Logistics. Right. What do we got? Uh, no. No, we don't want you switching lane back there, but maybe it's because you haven't got a choice in the matter. Oh, no, you've got choice in the matter. Coming out under there. And then back on over here. So if we, after that one, if we add this station. Hey, see? Yeah, it just works. Good. All right. That's smashing. And hopefully that's, actually, I could do with seeing the non train about now. In fact, I don't even need to because that track isn't connected to anything. So there we go. That's that's absolutely spot on. And this is going. No, you've named the route, not the sta not the station there. So this is going to be, uh, I guess, uh, Hamburg uh, brick. Right. Okay. And then the, the the station itself is is called the other thing. So get rid of get rid of that. Go open this. And this is Hamburg. Now, I admit this is an approximation of the of uh, Hamburg's location, but it feels like you know, uh, given Hamburg's nature as a, a major port uh, and uh, and you know freight distribution anyway, this felt like a good idea. Where's he going? Has the of the has the German traffic found an alternate route that works for it? Intriguing. I shall have to have a look. Uh, distribution. There we go. Good. Right. All right. Who, who are you? What are you doing? Paris food. Oh, we've we've allowed the Parisians to get food again. Well, that's jolly nice of us. Um, admittedly, I'm about to put all of you guys out of work, but uh, but that's 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 jolly thrilling. Okay, so that's the first one we've got to get set running. Next up is going to be our mixed consist uh, train from the Hamburg distribution. In fact, we'll do uh, one, two, three of these. Oh yeah. Oh, we're not doing anything by halves. I'm going to need that 283 million quid in order to buy trains uh, from Hamburg Distribution to uh, Berlin. Industrial. Ooh, nice. Um, do we need both tracks there? I mean, we can use them. You know, we've got we've got everything set up that we could possibly need. I guess it really depends on whether I, I will will leave that uh, to its own devices for now, uh, and then uh, we'll we'll review it later. So this is going to be Berlin goods bulk, right? So that's that one. Uh, next trick is going to be this one here, uh, which goes from Hamburg to this big fella. Come on, big fella. There we are. Uh, did we get it? No, we didn't. There we go. Paris Freight Station 1. 
Uh, I like Paris Paris Freight personally, although it's you know it's nowhere near Paris. So you know, but we'll we'll live with it. Uh, so this is going to be uh, PIR goods bulk. Now I want to check these two lines and make sure that they're both independent. They are both independent. Uh, next up, we need another new line, I think. Because I know I already had one, right? We're going to go from Hamburg up to yeah. And this is this is pretty exciting stuff. We're going to be we're going to be launching all of these at the same time. Uh, there we go. Copenhagen sidings, which is a terrible name. What's going on there? Okay, right. So if I put a signal on here. Uh, and then from after Hamburg, we stop at that one. There you go. See that the game gets it pretty quickly. Once you you know once you give it a, a, a general idea, it'll uh, it'll execute on it. And then we're going to need a signal there. We're going to a signal. I want to. I need it. it. Helps if you call up the signal tool man. There you go. Put a signal on that one, and then another one on one we've already got. That signal. There, we want to get rid of because it's too close to the junction. Uh, let's stick it in the middle of the bridge instead. There we are. Uh, the reason for for double tracking uh, Copenhagen and making sure it's doing so is because the tra the the distance travelled is a little longer. There's a very high chance that we end up running another train up here at some point as well. So go, that's Copenhagen sidings, uh, and then we just need to figure out the distribution from that end. Uh, which we obviously need to do before putting any trains in motion. And that comes round, takes this rather natty underground jaunt, and it's coming in on the wrong on the wrong track. Look, oh well, that will that will never do. Let's uh, add that into the into the mix. Add this one, please. No, didn't like that. Did not like that at all. Looks like they're going to be sharing. Well, that's, that's not that's not ideal. So, given that I don't have a lot of space to play with, we can stick a, a crossing in there. It's going to have to be quite a quite an efficient one, though. By which I mean quite a small one. There we are. Do a bit of that. There you are, see, that's that's the stuff. And then a bit like that. Uh, right, okay, so that's the cut. In fact, I ought to be lab labeling these as I go. So this is uh, COP, thank you, COP. Um, that one over there, what did we say that was? Paris? Black brown, whatever that is. Uh, this one is going to be uh, PAR1. PAR1. Uh, and then the one next to it is going to be PAR2. Uh, so right there. Yep, yep. This is all good. This is all good. Now, there's a very high chance that some of these will end up servicing uh, multiple um, Routes, but for now, I, I you know I kind of like the shorthand that we've got going on here. So if we go with that, uh, I'm definitely going to need to redevelop this line uh, because there there will be m multiple things going up and down it. And then this red one here is Berlin. All right, so we do that, and then we rename it B E R B E R. Right. Uh, and add it to the selection. Uh, right like that. Okay, good. Uh, right, so line two, this is going to be COP, Copenhagen uh, Goods Bulk. All right, right, and then we've got one more to do for now, and that's going to be uh, the British one, uh, which goes from Hamburg Distribution over the channel out to here. Now, the, I mean, the primary reason for this particular station is obviously is to uh, is to pick up this coal. But uh, 
it strikes me that uh, we don't. Uh, it would be wasteful not to have it as the the drop off for goods in the UK as well, or in sorry in Great Britain as well. Now you're backing onto yourself, so we can probably. I mean, I don't know how. I don't know how confused it's going to get if I do this. No, not confused at all. Well, that's that's good because there will be kind of a, a bulk coal train that uh, that makes use of that as well. Uh, let's might as well you know unify our signalling when we can. Do I mean unify or do I mean unite? They're both good, good bold sentiments anyway. Uh, right, and then we swing round here up onto. Maybe we're going to need a signal on there. Now we're not thinking coal just yet. We've got we've got a little way to go before we get to coal, uh, and nobody's using this one. Excellent. So this is going to be uh, for the British Isles. Or, uh, no, well, actually, this is just London, so uh, that's what we'll call it. Uh, L O N. Right, we're there. Okay, add station. L O N. Right, L O N. Goods. Bulk. Right, so that's uh, one delivery coming in alongside the food coming in. Oil, I will also have uh, have coming in pretty quickly. Um, well, when I say pretty quickly, I mean, you know, I'll set some ships in motion. Uh, but as you well know, they're, they're going to take a little while before they, you know, even wake up. Um, so next thing we need to do is uh, is make sure that we've got demand set correctly. So we'll start over here in London. Can we upgrade this dirt path? Because I've built that station very, very close to the, the uh, whatever the heck this thing is. Coal mine, that's what they call them. There we are, right, okay, so uh, I doubt we'll get medium country road, but we'll have a look anyway. Terrain alignment collision. Uh, where? Suspect it's this bridge. If we get rid of that bit, how do you feel about that? Uh, give me the, no, no, magic wand, please. Construction, not possible. Okay, well, what about something a bit smaller? There we go. Just because, you know, it feels like, you know, the time of dirt tracks is, is really a long way behind us now. So that's not exactly high capacity, but uh, but it should be uh, should be sufficient to, to, you know, move stuff around. Or at least it, it will allow the, the connection to count. Uh, and then give me medium street. Thump that around there. Now, I think we will go... Let's have a look at demand because we're going to need both blue demand this this stuff here and actually we can we can hit some of that from from the station can't we barely all right so you're gonna want to you're gonna want to drop off over here somewhere all right well we can we can do that that's no trouble at all uh, let's go for for one of these large industry chaps up here actually no 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 no. you're doing this in the wrong order do the drop off first all right drop off and hopefully this will have a nice catchment area it's not it's not that great that's better right stick that on there um and then we want another one of those to cover this industrial splurge we've got going on here uh, speak to me, talk to me, tell me things. That's pretty good. That's that's not bad. Uh, what about around the corner? That's better. Okay. Then we we have an accord, right? So we're going to need two truck lines for London. And I mean, I'm sure you've noticed already that my frame rate has now started to degrade pretty severely. So. Uh, we want to be, uh, I guess, somewhat sparing. Actually, you, you've jumped the gun there. You want to get your, you want to get your country road set. Country road. We'll go large if at all possible. In fact, let's upgrade to large. There you go. That's the, that's the business. Uh, stick a truck stop on it. Let's go for a large industrial truck stop. Slide it in there, and everybody's happy. Yep. 
and then both lots are going over that bit of bridge there, which is a terrible route. So maybe I can, yeah, you see, that's what that's what we should be doing here is, is if we run, uh, run that out there a bit further, run this along here. And then we can we can probably effect a, a bypass of some description. Uh, we'll, we'll make it a nice coastal road while we're at it, because you know, why the hell not? Right, and then of course it's not going to let me. This is not going to let me do a bridge of any description. Well, how does it feel about tunnels? Right. Well, if we uh, if we go all the way over there. And then go, take her underground. Nope, too much slope. But over here, not too much slope. Keep going so we can make it as shallow as possible. There we are. Hey, can we pull it back a bit? Probably can pull it back a bit. Right about there would be absolutely dandy. There we are. And on to the end. Excellent. Well, that's 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 come up very nicely. So if the if the game's got any ruddy sense in the slightest, and you know we we obviously can't rule that out, um, uh, it will take the bypass. Speak to me. Uh, we've chosen grey, which is not going to show up at all. Choose turquoise. It helps if you put the right bits in place. Let's get rid of that. London Central, uh, ad station this chap over here. Perfect. That's good. Now we could carry on along the tram route here, but to be honest, I, I think we can we, we may be able to sell them on on uh, on sticking with with a bypass. Do you want to do you want to go straight there? I mean, I realize I've No, 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 no. all right. Well, let's let's go as far as here and take it around the corner. Like that. This one possibly less likely, you know, almost certainly less likely. Right, let's make you uh, this green here. Add station, uh, add add station. Thank you, autosave. You're the real MVP. Uh, from Lower London over to this one. No, you've decided to to cut straight through the middle using the most heinous route possible. Well, on your own head, be it. Can't. Uh, can't talk you into something you don't want to do. So this is going to be uh, London Industrial, London Industry. Uh, this one's London Commercial, London Commerce. All right, splendid. Uh, and now we'll buy some trucks and get them going. So uh, that's trams. No, no, we must. Uh, have we not got a truck? We've not got a truck emporium in town. All right, we'll we'll build one then. Uh, road depot. Hook it up on there. No, hook it up on here. No, hook it up on there. Indecision. It's uh, it's a tormentor. Uh, right. Okay. So we'll go with. Uh, well, let's let's start with three, four on each. All cargo man truck. That could that could work for us. Uh, will does it take it takes crude? Does it take fuel? It does take fuel. It does everything. Then it's the way to go. I would rather use specialized trucks, but uh, but at the end of the day, um, I'm going to use trucks that that get the job done. So let's paint you that color, and we'll go for four. One, two, three, four, and set that on London. One of them. Uh, London Commerce. There you go. Get to work. Kill that off. Uh, kill these off as well. There you go. And then we'll buy another four. One. No, uh, didn't want that one orange. No, didn't mind. Two, three, four. Set one. London Industry. Okay, cool. Alright, kill all of those vehicles. Color. Uh, industry is going to be brown. Splendid. So there we go. I, 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 that's more gold than it is orange. I mean, I'm not complaining. It looks terrific. Uh, okay, so London is ready to rock. So that will now generate some interest in whatever I distribute from here, uh, which means that I can bring brick in. It means that I can bring fuel in. That's great. Um, what else do we need? Well, we need Paris as well. So let's do Paris. 
Hey, if you ever wanted to see repetitive actions being done, you've come to the right place. Uh, right, so once again, we'll use a nice big fat cargo station here. This should be in range of the freight station. Feels like it is. Do we need to go this way? Maybe spin it around here by the by the terminal. Well, that's definitely a range. All right, there we go. Uh, I don't know if I could have stuck it by the second entrance and it worked, but uh, you know, who's uh, who's counting? Uh, right, bang that up there, please. And just because I'm in a connecting thing, it's kind of a mood. Uh, then we'll uh, we'll run a run a one of those down there, and then. Do you want to squeak through there? Yeah, you do. All right. Everybody's happy. Um, what are you doing now? Uh, I don't know. Look, firstly, let's find out what Parisian stuff we have running anyway. So we've got Paris Brick, uh, this is, which is a road line. Okay. Currently got nothing on it. So we'll, we'll, uh, we'll reformat that one. Uh, well, it's Paris Food. That one also we shall reformat. Uh, Paris Stone needs to stay as it is, although these trucks could do with uh, a, a touch of modernization. I may even run um, stone down from, uh, well, I'm going to run stone from the, the, the main line, but uh, we'll we'll worry about that shortly. What can we get on this flatbed? Because I'd run a flatbed if we'd, if we'd got, no, it's, no, it's just not, it's not doing it for me. You got goods, machines, tools, goods, no. This one, livestock, no. Food, no. Tipper truck, yes, there we go, we'll use that. Uh, and we'll paint that gray, rather like that which it is uh, It is transporting. Stick it on 100%, obviously I'd been buying trucks there for, uh, for no good reason for quite some time. So if we leave that on 25%, maybe some of those will get replaced. Um, Boy, can, I can't wait for the new update, which apparently is going to bring in the, the ability to uh, uh, replace stuff right now. Uh, no hanging around. On the subject of no hanging around, I shall stop hanging around. Let's uh, let's do this. So we're going to redirect those two Paris, yeah, those two Paris lines. Uh, this one we shall turn into uh, Paris. Uh, what do we say? Commerce. And then this one will be Paris industry industry all right paris commerce goes from paris branch at the moment where the hell is that that's north all right so we remove north and we'll add this jaunty little zurich north oh yeah okay why not um what route have you gone for there you've gone for this route here which looks great uh, so that's fine, and that's already got trucks on it. Uh, the industry line goes to the exchange, which I guess it is there. Well, I don't guess. It is there, which is that one, and then it comes from here, and we need to buy some trucks to stick on that. So, yeah, so, we, I mean, basically, I've got, to, I've got to repeat a fair bit of this in order to get it working, but uh, but once once that's done... This should all be kind of cool. Right, Paris Industry. We want generic freight trucks, please. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. I know, Paris is a special case. Uh, and then you're on Paris Industry. Paris begins with a P. There you are. Industry. There you are. And we're off and running. Good. Right, so that's Paris and London dealt with. Uh, do we really think that keeping an eye on this is going to do us any favours at all? No, we probably don't. Let's just leave it going. Now, those trucks are half a million a throw, so let's uh, let's set it properly and just leave it to, to generate over time. There we are. Okay, right, so that's Paris done, that's London done. Copenhagen might be close enough to the areas that it needs to hit. Then again, it might not be, but uh, but we won't know unless we have a look. So here's Copenhagen sidings, and that hits a good chunk of blue and a tiny little bit of yellow. That might be enough, you know. 
I'm going to leave that alone. We don't, right, we don't need a truck. We don't need a truck set up for Copenhagen. He gambled. Um, and then Berlin, uh, we, shall, uh, we shall move the Berlin set up around some. Uh, hello there, Berlin food. And then presumably I've got a Berlin brick line around the place somewhere. There we go, we do look. Right, where's Berlin? F oh, it's, it's there, all right. Berlin brick is just a just a little out of date uh, in terms of its vehicle choices. Um, let's uh, let's set the replacement on that differently, shall we? We'll stick with this man truck. I, I quite like it. Uh, turn it green just for the sake of it. Uh, make it twenty five percent. Keep an eye on the vehicles, uh, and then we want to adjust the route. Knickers uh, overview. So that currently does. Well, we want both of these. We want everything to go from over here, really, don't we? So, uh, branch does what? Berlin branch to Berlin transfer. Where's transfer? Where's that? It's always over there. Okay, so that's fine. That's actually doing exactly what I want it to do. In which case. Carry on. You may you may be about your business. Berlin food, however, is what's going from Paris north, which is up there. So we're going to change that out uh, and go to uh, Berlin branch again. Now that's that's a far shorter jaunt, but the uh, the upshot should be pretty positive. You're done. Good. All right. I think that's it. I think we're there. So that's one, two, three, four. So we've got four there that will work just fine. Um, we now just need to do the, the trains themselves. So we want green and uh, purple. Well, let's do... So green is on uh, the first block, which means it can come from either of these first two. Okay, right, well. I guess here's where we... Oh, hello, there's a train in here. Uh, how about we sell it? There you go, that's a, that's a novel idea. Right, let's buy one. Okay, so the, the, we're, we're looking for a mixed consist train, and uh, it's it's European. All right, what have we got? We've got this Norwegian number, which is a pretty heavy hauler, and it's pretty fast as well. Class 246 is okay. The 185 is much more suited. Yeah, okay. Or we've got this Norwegian chap here, which is incredibly powerful. Attractive effort, maybe not so much. Uh, what about a class 35? There you go. Whoa. Rah! That's what that one says. Uh, no, not 35, 37. Beg your pardon. Um, all right, I like it. I, 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 I like this as a notion. And uh, we will use the, the rail freight grey. For this uh, right so we want one of those okay and then it's because it's hauling multiple goods types so we've got box cars I realize these are American but this is the alternative and it takes seven less right why would I why would I even bother doing that uh, and this will carry goods which we will be producing food which we already do produce so we'll have a good few of those uh, let's go with Actually, let's make these a consistent color. Because you're the first one, you can have my favorite color gray. Uh, right, one, two, three, four, five. In fact, let's make sure that can take 100. Right, so that's 100 food that that can carry, which is more than it's ever going to need to carry, but there you go. Uh, we then want to carry construction material 18 or 13. Well, we'll go with the 18, obviously. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, six of those. And then at some point, we'll have fuel available as well. So we'll take uh, one, two, three, four of those. Okay, that's uh, that, I imagine, is quite the train. But there we go. There's the, there's the consist we've gone with. How long is it? 0.3 kilometers, so 300 meters long. We've got room for a bit more on there, but I, I think we'll leave it alone. Um, right, that one. What did I decide that was? That was the that's coming out of that's coming out of shed two. Thank you. I'm done with you. 
so it can be any of these. Let's make that Paris. All right, so Paris what? Goods bulk. P-A-R, goods bulk. Go. Go? We are go. Right, stop. Uh, right, next up, you know I'm stopping it because I'm going to launch them all at once. Uh, that's that's going to be quite exciting. Right, okay, uh, it's not going to be quite exciting. Stop waffling. Uh, green, green is our next one, uh, which will take out a shed one. And I want a very similar consist. By trains, locomotives. Uh, we'll stick with the rail freight. There you go, have one of those. Wagons, these ones, uh, London, red, why not? Uh, not quite so vivid, definitely. Uh, 108 of that, All right, and then state car, 108 of that, two, three, four, five, six, and then 60 crude oil. Now, I may, uh, well, not may, I will tinker about with this. Uh, as uh, as we get rolling to make sure that I'm hitting demand correctly uh, but for the moment I, I you know I'm relatively comfortable about this so that's London goods bulk right and then stop right there okay good right what's next uh, Berlin which is on the red line which means it's coming out of this this last shed here this is this is all going to work perfectly you know this is going to look absolutely tremendous. You're going to want to set your uh, your screen grabber per of choice to watch this uh, this uh, escapade as it kicks off. Berlin, what are we, uh, Berlin uh, green? Uh, one, two, three, four. Are you keeping count here? Where's 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 that popping up? That's over there. Uh, five, six, uh, and then six of these one two three four five six and then a couple of your oil tankers three four good berlin route for you uh berlin goods bulk all right you can stop uh and then let's let's close these these redundant depots down all right and then we have the copenhagen line which is this tan kind of color which is the same one so I think we can probably get that out of shed three uh, by a train if you wanted an episode that was all about repeating the same action over and over again well look no further you know we're on it we're we're repeating the same action repeatedly repeating repeatedly beautiful work purple Copenhagen one two three four five I believe it's six yes it is State car, one, two, three, four, five, six, which is going to look a little bit odd. And then purple jelly, four of. All right, and you're on the Copenhagen goods bulk. Right, that's those ready to go. And then we just need Berlin brick, which is the brown one. Berlin brick. Yeah, that's brown. It's very brown. Now that's going to be taking construction material only, um, but also if it could carry stone, that would be helpful because we can we can hook that up. What you were looking for there was which shed do you want? Three or four, please. Locomotives, and I think we'll go with the. Uh, do we want the alternate? No, we'll we'll stick with we'll stick with what's working. We'll go with one of those, and then nothing but state cars. So this can carry. Uh, construction material, it can't carry stone. Ah, oh, that's annoying. You need a you need a hopper to carry stone. In fact, uh, no, you don't. You want an open wagon. How frustrating! Okay, well, we're not going to double dip because otherwise, you know, I I restrict the amount that I can bring with me. So we're just going with these chaps here. And we'll make that in black. And I want to be bringing out. Well, I'm going to need to bring out about 400, right? That's 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 a beast of a train. That one, right? Okay. So your Berlin brick bulk? No. Yes? Question mark. Query. Is that the right line? Because if it's the wrong line. No. You see. Look. That's green. 
What's what's the brown line called? It's Hamburg Brick. There we are. You're on Hamburg Brick. Right. On pause all of those. Kill that. Kill all of these. And these. Come on, quickly, you're missing it. It's like the Teletubbies emerging uh, on a sunny morning. There you go. So much as we did in the US, uh, we are now launching a, a you know an epic fleet of uh, of cargo. I'm sorry, I'm trying to find a good spot here to to sit and look. Those wagons are not the right scale. That's not the angle I want. I want something kind of like this, I suppose. There you go. We can we can hide in these bushes. All right, so with these guys going, I mean, we should ship food relatively quickly. Those wagons are not the right scale. How frustrating is that? Yeah, I might get some modded wagons. If you've got a recommendation for, for modded wagons you'd like to see, please do let me know. I'll, uh, I'll look them up. So, you know, particularly stuff with a, a kind of a container idea to them I'll give those a give those a spin but there we go you wanted to see a lot of metal thrown up and down this new look new route you're looking at it there you go everybody picks up can't help but think you might be on the wrong line there sunshine where are you going you're going Paris you're fine Okay, and then we should immediately behind that have the uh, the brick super train come in. There we go. It's, that's that's quite that's quite the view. Yeah, on reflection, painting them all the same colour makes them look a bit silly. Uh, I think we'll we'll duck that in the future. Right. Now, you were hired for the job because you've got a hell of a lot of power and your tractive effort is respectable, right? So you better be better than everything that Norway had to offer. I'm just saying. Right, let's, uh, let's get out ahead of uh, this Parisian number and uh, see what we get here in terms of, oh my gosh, what a beautiful camera angle. I see. I'm not feeling a beautiful camera angle at the moment. There we go. This will do. So there we go. We got we uh, got the Stadler flirting its way across there, going under. Yeah. See, this is this is all. This is this is what we what we turned up for. Hopefully, in the future, it will it will be what we turned up for plus an almighty amount of cargo being chucked around. And there's a plane that should have been updated ages ago. Oi, yo, come here. Oi. Come here, just, oi, you, yeah, you. I'm pretty sure I told you to replace. I did tell you to replace. You're just not replacing, because you're not 100% old yet? That seems unlikely. Um, anyway, there we go. Right, so, uh, how's that looking at this end? Now, this should kick the, uh, the production of food into properly high gear. Uh, we also need to set another route up here, a new line from... Hamburg. Oh yeah, yeah, this is the route we're setting up. Yeah, yeah. Out to, my goodness me, um, out to Port Nelson. Yeah, you can do that. Yeah, good. And this is going to be uh, P-O-R Ham. Now, I could, I, I, I was paying attention to those who said that, yes, you can, um, yeah, you can transport fuel by plane, you just need to use the right plane. Um, that's, that's worth knowing. However, uh, I, I think I prefer using oil tankers to get this done. So let's, uh, let's, let's get a couple of them rolling. Uh, what have we got here? Merlin. No. Look like uh, it's a container ship. Uh, it's the Viola, isn't it? Yeah, Viola. Right, we'll have three. One, two, three. Yes. No messing around here. Uh, you lot, get it done. Uh, Port Nelson to Hamburg. There you are. 
set those chaps in motion. Now, it's going to be absolutely ages before they make their first delivery, but it's going to be totally worth it when they do. Uh, what do I need to do about that? We need to be setting a truck line here uh, to ferry that stuff around. So, there we are. Because if I don't do it now, I'll only forget. But there we go. That's going to uh, that's going to get us to over the finishing line for today. Um, and this is going to be H A M uh, fuel shuttle. There we are. Uh, yeah, that's 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 all we need to do for now. And uh, let's get a let's get a freight car. I'm going to keep saying, you know, trying to end the end of the show. Two, three, set line. Hamburg fuel shuttle. There we are. So there we go. That's going to be all we're going to do for today. Uh, and it's going to, you know, it's, it's going to take a little while for all this to pick up speed. That all wants to go to Paris. Oh, uh, okay. Um, we'll, we'll just have to see what happens with, with future goods that turn up. Yeah, look. Oh, yeah. Actual petrol tankers. I love it. Um... Yeah, you know, stuff's going around. Um, and so, in the next episode, what are we going to do next? Uh, I think we will have a look at getting goods set up as well. Because obviously goods we can distribute using these existing trains. Uh, which are going to cost me an arm and a leg until we've got a bit more goods for them to actually transport. But uh, that shouldn't, shouldn't take long. One would hope. Where's my brick train? Here's the brick train. And the brick train is carrying how much? 306 construction materials. So this is going to pick up nice and fast. Uh, where are you going? You are going... Oh, you're going on the wacky underground. Okay, cool. Well, we'll watch, we'll watch you do that. Um, thank you very much for watching today. I've been Colonel Failure. Uh, throw a like at this one if you dare. Not many dare. I'm, I'm pretty sure you're one of them, though. You've got that look about you. Uh, and subscribe if you've not done so already so you don't miss out on what remains of this series. I'm really hoping that the, the, the game's performance stays up uh, long enough for me to, uh, to explore a few ideas. Uh, and I have something very specific in mind with Rome uh, that you're probably not going to want to miss. Um, so thanks for watching today. I'll catch up with you very soon. We have to wait for the train to finish going past. It takes a while. It's a long train. Almost there. And... Cheerio!